What's good guys, if you guys want the most cheap and most reliable FIFA 23 coins, make sure you guys check out u7buy.com. Next time you guys want to make your purchase, type in the code DAN to get 6% off. Also, if you guys ever want to sell your FIFA 23 coins, you just go to the help center and click on the selling section. Yo YouTube, what's going on? Welcome to another video to the channel, y'all boys. And the moment of truth is finally here. I'm here to rank the top 10 best strikers of fifa 23 ultimate team at this stage of the game this 1000 percent is the most difficult list i've had to do the whole year so i just want to say we're most likely not going to have the same list so you guys let me know in the comment section down below who has been your favorite striker of fifa 23 ultimate team also before i get into the list i do want to say for today's list i'm only going to be including central position based players so cams center forwards and strikers no wingers will be in today's list no 99 peles no shapeshifter icons on re no foot birthday jarzinho's none of those cards will be on today's list so just strictly central position based with that being said let's get into the first honorable mention and see if you guys already disagree with me off the first choice coming in the first honorable mention is going to be shapeshifters icon garincha 98 rated 57 high medium right foot Five star skill moves, four star weak foot, 94 pace, 98 shooting, 90 passing, 98 dribbling, 84 physicality, and he has the finesse shot trait and outside the foot shot trait as well. What I do love about this Garincha card when I reviewed him is that they made a shooting absolutely top tier with 99 finishing, 98 shot power, 99 tag positioning. Garincha already had the class dribbling, he was just missing the consistent shooting, and with this card, this is exactly what you get. Only reason why he's not higher up on the list is because the body type is a little bit of a liability, but 84 strength and 78 aggression does compensate it a little bit. Second honorable mention is going to be my boy 97 rated team of the season, Erlen Haaland, 6'5", high medium left foot, 4 star skill moves, 5 star weak foot, 97 pace, 97 shooting, 82 passing, 90 dribbling, 95 physicality, no shooting traits in game. You already know I had to include the biggity boy Haaland one of my favorite cards this year in FIFA. And if you're one of those guys that just spam step overs, you know exactly what I mean. This card is still very broken to this stage of the game. All right, yeah, boys, now we're going into the top 10. And number 10 is 96 rated footies SBC Tammy Abraham, 6'5", high medium work rates, right foot, five star skill moves, four star weak foot, 96 pace, 96 shooting, 90 passing, 96 dribbling, 93 physicality, finesse shot trade, and outside the foot shot trade as well very similar to erlen Haaland, but this card edges it over Haaland because he got the five star skill moves very broken sbc there's not much to say about him coming number nine is going to be team of the season 95 rated christopher and kunku 59 high medium work rates right foot five star in the skill moves and weak foot 97 pace 91 shooting 93 passing 97 dribbling 77 defending 81 physicality and he has both finesse shot trade and outside the foot shot trade as well i love this card man for me i still think he's top 10 his step overs are absolutely amazing with that 97 agility 99 balance very consistent shooting i love his versatility and the pitch as well he can play anywhere but him as a striker role i still enjoy him to this day coming number eight is going to be 99 rated footies neymar we're looking at a car that's five nine high medium work rates right foot double five star in the skill moves and weak foot 99 pace 96 shooting 95 passing 99 dribbling 70 physicality finesse shot trade and outside the foot shot trade as well not really much to say about neymar he's really good with the consistent finishing with this card a little bit of an upgrade over the team of season moment maxed out pace pretty much maxed out dribbling and decent enough physicality if you give him the architect chemistry style. Coming in number seven is going to be 97 radius shape shifters Paul Pogba, 6'3, high low work rates, right foot, double five star in the skill moves and weak foot, 95 pace, 97 shooting, 91 passing, 95 dribbling, 95 physicality, and he has the finesse shot trade and outside the foot shot trade as well. This card is basically like a Tammy Abraham and an Erlen Halling into one. You get the physical presence consistent shooting the um, bundle slash lucky rebounds the card gets whenever you're dribbling with him he gets on lengthy and he's double five absolutely very broken card guys if you guys want a top tier striker and still playing fifa 23 
highly recommend him for the rebounds and the lucky bullshit goals now coming number six is probably gonna be somebody that's not really that you know popular but in my opinion he's very very good and it's going to be 97 rated footies alvarez 58 high high work grits right foot double five starting skill moves and weak foot 95 pace 97 shooting 93 passing 95 dribbling 86 physicality and he has the finesse shot trade as well very very broken card when it comes to the finishing aspect dribbling was absolutely top tier as well with that 99 agility 99 bounds very quick as well since he does have 95 pace i feel like this card is a little bit under the radar because he's not one of the big boy names but for those of you guys that have tried out this card you guys know what i'm talking about all right we're getting into the top five and it's obviously going to be very controversial so go ahead and just let me know what you guys think uh, but number five is going to be 97 rated team of the season killing and Mbappe. six foot high low work rids right foot five star skill moves four star weak foot 99 pace 97 shooting 87 passing 99 dribbling 85 physicality and he has the outside the foot shot trade as well not much to say about Kylian Mbappe we all know his body he's always going to be the best card in the game regardless of his team this season gets released months ago last week it doesn't matter it's just Mbappe this year in FIFA 23 he has a very broken offensive AI with that maxed out pace everything in the dribbling category is basically 99 shooting is basically 99 and really good physicality as well all right, and number four is going to be 94 rated foot birthday icon Eusebio. 5'9 high medium work rates, right foot, 94 pace, 94 shooting, 87 passing, 94 dribbling, 80 physicality, no shooting traits in game. Eusebio, guys, with the double five was a huge game changer. I'm going to go ahead and stick by him and say he's still top five in the game. Very, very broken when it comes to everything, the dribbling very smooth with the reverse elastico animations consistent and obviously shooting because previous eusebio versions were very broken when it came to the finishing with this one being double five go with the dribbling still go with the finishing coming number three is going to be that cover star icon spc 98 rated ronaldinho 511 high medium work rates right foot double five star on the skill moves and weak foot 98 pace 94 shooting 95 passing 99 dribbling 88 physicality and he has both finesse shot trade and outside the foot shot trade as well similar to my wingers video just like he's in the strikers video this card can play all over the pitch in the attack very good with the physical presence top tier dribbling consistent shooting now that he has five star weak foot very very quick with the maxed out pace as well number two is going to be 99 rated premium footies cristiano ronaldo 6-2 high low work rates right foot Double five star in the skin moves and weak foot, 97 pace, 99 shooting, 93 passing, 97 dribbling, 88 physicality, and he has the finesse shot trade and outside the foot shot trade as well. I put this card in the wingers video, but obviously without a doubt, he is way better in the pitch as a striker than as a winger. Very, very nice dribbling with everything in the 99s, 99 reactions, 99 ball control, 99 composure. Physical presence is there as well. You basically get a team of the year CR7 from FIFA 19 and FIFA 18 in this card. Very, very broken to say the least. But number one, the best striker of FIFA 23 to finish off the game cycle, in my opinion, is going to be still the man, 97 rated Trophy Titans icon R9. Six foot high medium work rates, right foot, double five star on the skill moves and weak foot, 97 pace, 96 shooting, 82 passing, 96 dribbling, 82 physicality, and he has the finesse shot trade as well. I don't know, man. I don't think R9 will ever get dethroned in FIFA. Maybe I'm just an R9 fanboy, but he's just very broken, you know, with the shooting, with the bundles, and with his physical presence. And with this R9, you have an R9 that can actually wiggle and bad gameplay with 92 agility, 90 balance, 97 ball control. This is honestly the perfect card. There's nothing wrong with this card. It's actually insane. But you guys let me know what do you guys think about my final list my top 10 strikers list of FIFA 23. Who do you think I missed out on? I know I missed out on a lot of cards, but just because they're not on this list, I don't think they're bad. I just think that these are better. For example, I know Shapeshifters Mahrez is a good shout. Team of Season Benzema is a good shout as well, but I just can't put myself to replace these cards for those. You guys let me know who has been your favorite. Thank you guys so much for supporting all the videos. That concludes my set of rankings of FIFA 23. I will not be doing another set of rankings for each set of positions. Maybe I'll drop one for goalkeepers, maybe, you know, in a week or two. But when it comes to CBs, fullbacks, DMs, wingers, and strikers, that's it. 
no more until EAFC 24. I'm obviously still going to be dropping videos of FIFA 23 player reviews. I assume you're going to drop some end of an air SBCs and stuff like that. Stay tuned into that. If you guys are enjoying the FIFA content and the channel, thank you guys so much for support. It's been your boy Dan FIFA and I am out. Bye bye.